and more than a thousand Thai anti-government protesters clashed with police on Saturday. They demonstrated against the government's failure to handle coronavirus outbreaks and its impact on the economy. About 100 police officers uh, in riot gear sealed off a road near the Victory Monument in the capital Bangkok. They had containers uh, and used water cannons, tear gas and rubber bullets to stop a march uh, towards Government House, the office of Prime Minister Prayut Chanocha. Tear gas and rubber bullets were used to crowd control and the demonstrators threw ping pong bombs, stones and marbles. More than a thousand anti-government protesters clashed with police in Bangkok on Saturday as they demonstrated against what they said was the government's failure to handle coronavirus outbreaks and its impact on the economy. About 100 police officers in riot gear sealed off a road near Victory Monument in the capital and used water cannon, tear gas and rubber bullets to stop a march towards Government House, the office of Prime Minister Prayut Chan Ocha. Police say the protesters were violent. People aren't getting vaccines yet. We want Prayut to resign because we want the economy to develop. We don't have jobs and income, so we have no choice but to protest. Dozens of protesters were seen being carried away on motorcycles and in ambulances. The Erawan Emergency Medical Center said at least two civilians and three officers had been injured. Roughly 6% of Thailand's population of more than 66 million people has been fully vaccinated. Gatherings of more than five people are currently banned, and most of the country, including Bangkok, is under lockdown with a nighttime curfew. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.